The purpose of staging is to direct attention to the more important things within a scene. As you can see, our hero is looking at the world in which he must pass to reach his objective. Arcs give the scene a natural action and better flow, which you can see by our hero getting targeted by enemies and the arrows flying through the air. Exaggeration is over the top actions used in cartoons to draw attention and make the scene more attractive. Anticipation is an action leading to an event like the reactions of someone catching a ball by putting their hands up in the air or like someone cowering in fear as they are melted alive. A good example of slow in slow out animation is the gradual progression of speed leading up to the peak speed and then decreasing back down to a full stop. This can be shown by a car moving or our hero running. Our hero was drawn frame by frame which gives him a more fluid motion and realistic appearance whereas his enemy has a beginning and an end with the gaps in between filled with a twain. This gives a puppet like appearance. The best way we thought of to animate the principle of follow through and overlapping was to show our hero swimming. For the follow through action the leading arm will move forward while the other will drop back. An overlapping action is the tendency for body parts to move at different speeds. The principle is the concept of composing an image starting with the basic components being drawn while adding the detail along the way to produce what you now see as the complete image. This portrays weight, volume, density and the illusion of three dimensions. Secondary action supports the main action to give the scene more life. For example, when a person walks, their arms swing simultaneously, or a ninja walking through a cave, holding a torch with the flame flickering with his movement. The timing refers to the speed at which the actions take place on a purely physical level, for example, Timing jumps over gravestones and at the point of contact with a dead zombie's head. In live performances, actors portray charisma, whereas animated characters have appeal. Whether they are good, the bad, or the ugly, the smart, the hilarious, or the stupid, it gives a character personality. This is the most important principle and gives a sense of weight and flexibility to the drawn objects. It can be applied to simple objects like a bouncing ball or complex objects like the bones of a ninja impacting the ground.